hi guys welcome to technical tips and today I will be showing you how to uninstall and reinstall Google Chrome and in order to do that actually there are several ways but uh, I will tell you the easiest way and for that I mean to do that we will have to go to uninstall or change program and in order to do that you need to right click on the start button which you see at the bottom left corner those four squares simply right click and click the option run and you just need to type a p p w i z dot c p l and simply click ok once you click OK, you will see the list of all programs which can be uninstalled. So, look for Google Chrome. Highlight that by clicking on it once and click Uninstall. Wait for a minute and yeah, if it asks you, please call or close all Google Chrome windows and try again. Then make sure you close all active Google Chrome windows. I'll be closing this window and I'll click on install again. Now this is the important thing if you put a check there it will delete all your personal settings like if you have saved any password or um, favorites and all. So I'm not going to do that but if you want to completely remove Google Chrome then put a check there and simply click uninstall. Uninstallation may take a minute or even less than that so uninstallation for Google Chrome has been completed uh, Google just wants you to tell them what exactly is the reason that you removed Google Chrome so I'm not going to do that anyway uh, I will close the window I will close this window again and now in order to reinstall Google Chrome simply click on Microsoft Edge or you may have Internet Explorer which is there uh, you can use any browser it doesn't matter and simply uh, go to google.com and in order to install Google Chrome there are several ways so you can even install it uh, when you go to Google Chrome at the right top corner you will notice that uh, uh, there's a message Google works better than, better with Chrome so yes get Chrome now or you can search for Chrome also so you can type anything Chrome Chrome download download Chrome whatever you are comfortable with and you, you can click on download now but here you will have to be a little bit careful because uh, you may end up downloading Google Chrome uh, with ads so the best way is to simply click that icon the reason I'm showing you you can click this is a Google uh, website so you click there you can download it from here also or to make it simple you can click on that most of the time you don't get that message so I'll be downloading it from the link I clicked on that link and I clicked on Chrome uh, that also depends upon you if you want Google to send you uh, information or they want uh, you want them to capture information uh, but it will not be your personal information so don't worry about that it doesn't make, uh, make any difference it will not be your personal details I'll keep it checked because that's no problem for, with me and click on accept and install as soon as you do that just notice at the bottom of the page you will see Chrome setup, Chrome setup exe and they want you to either run or save sometime if it depends upon the browser which you are using since I'm using Internet Explorer I'm getting these options if you use if you will use Microsoft Edge you will see option to save save as and cancel so you'll have to click on save but I'm not going to click on save because I don't want this exe file to be saved on my computer I will directly install it so I'll click run and when you if you use Firefox then also you'll get, uh, get the message to save I mean there will not be any other choice so 
you can click save it doesn't matter you can save it but later you can delete it and this is your user account control click yes and just wait for some time and when it will be installed you will see the window will open up automatically in some cases it may ask you so we'll wait here thank you Okay, that's it. There you go. This is uh, Google Chrome window and I already have my favorites and everything because I had saved them and I did not delete my personal settings when I removed Google Chrome. So this is how Google Chrome looks like. So this is how you can search for websites in Google Chrome because most of the time what I have observed people type their website address in the search bar that is wrong. You can search for things which you are not sure or if uh, uh, you have some keywords to search but when you have a website that starts with www and ends with .com. Uh, always make sure you type the address up at the top in the address bar, not in a search bar. Well, thank you very much for watching this video and give it a thumbs up. Uh, I request you to subscribe to my channel to see more videos like that. Thank you very much and you have a great day. Bye-bye.